Welcome to the Global Symposium for Regulators 2019 here in Port Vila, Vanuatu, where I'm very pleased to be joined in the studio today by Dorian Bogdan Martin, who is the Director of the Telecommunication Development Bureau for ITU. Dorian, welcome to the studio. Thank you, Max. Great to be here. Now, I'd like to ask you a little bit about GSR. Why is GSR a unique gathering? So the GSR is a unique gathering because it's the only global platform that brings together the world's regulators. Today we have 168 uh, separate regulators and it's the only event uh, that brings them all together uh, annually. It's an event that was started in, uh, in 2000 uh, and since then the uh, regulatory population has grown to 168. Now, this year's theme for GSR is inclusive connectivity. It's focusing on the future of regulation. Uh, why is this important, do you think? It's important because we have succeeded in getting half the world online, but half the world's not online. And we know that getting the other half of the world online is not going to be so simple. We know that the regulatory approaches that were used to get the first half connected which were largely based on uh, competition and market liberalization, are not going to be the right practices to get the other half of the world online. So uh, we're gathered here to look at what we need to do, uh, what are the challenges that regulators and the private sector are facing, uh, and how can we face those challenges together. Okay, well, let's go into a little bit more depth then. Countries worldwide are going through rapid digital transformation, as you know. Technologies such as Internet of Things, artificial intelligence, 5G, uh, already here or certainly on their way. What can regulators do to keep pace with these changes? Regulators need to find a balance. They don't need to be heavy-handed and risk stifling innovation and growth. They need to strike a balance between uh, public and private interest and really uh, try to find ways that they can uh, really be connecting the last mile, the last billion. Uh, so I think it's all about balance and finding uh, sort of, um, you know, the best approach to uh, fostering and enabling uh, the needed investment and helping to, to grow their, their connectivity numbers. You mentioned before half the world is still not connected. I wanted to ask you what more could countries do to fast track connectivity? I think countries need to be more collaborative, and that's very much the theme of this year's G GSR. It's about uh, collaboration, ways that we can cooperate, uh, the ways that we can better communicate with each other, with different stakeholders. Uh, we see that getting the other half online is not going to be something totally left to the private sector, nor is it going to be something that's left entirely to the public sector. So it's really about collaboration. Uh, how can we work together through partnerships uh, and how can everybody take responsibility to ensure that we get the other half of the world connected? Finally, this year's uh, GSR is in Port Vila in, in Vanuatu. It's uh, given an opportunity for a lot of people to come, sometimes great distances, uh, to uh, get a, a, a view of what the world is like over here and what the challenges might be. Uh, I just wanted to ask you finally, what do you hope that people will take away with them from this year's symposium? I think everyone has been, um, let's say, delighted by the really warm welcome that we have received here in, in Vanuatu. The government has gone uh, above and beyond in making us all feel at home. Uh, Vanuatu, as you may know, is ranked number one in terms of risk of natural disasters. Um, so a country very much at risk that has suffered uh, tremendous uh, cyclones uh, in the past. And, and they've done a lot to use technology to prepare their people and to respond uh, to limit the damage. Uh, yet at the same time, Vanuatu is also ranked one of the happiest countries. Uh, and so I think colleagues will leave here feeling um, optimistic about the future, feeling happy. Uh, and, and feeling better informed that we've all learned something from each other and that together we can really make a difference. Dr. Martin, thank you very much indeed. Thank you.